Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Melvin, and I'm here today to talk to you about the return of Dawngate. Dawngate was an ill-fated multiplayer online battle arena or MOBA game developed by Waystone Games and published by Electronic Arts. Dawngate had a rich beta testing period during 2013 and all the way through 2014. Until November the 4th, 2014, it was announced that the game would be shut down in 90 days. And since the day the game closed, both the MOBA genre and the Dawngate community has had a hole left by the absence of Dawngate. Not without multiple attempts to bring the game back to life, numerous open letters and petitions and even a Kickstarter hosted by the community to try and bring the game back to the foray of MOBAs. However, most of these have been in vain. EA has discontinued any communication with the community, and of the numerous teams and projects that were brought together to bring the game back to life, very few remain. Now, with the end of 2016 looming close upon us, three individual projects have appeared. The first, Aetherforged, what is considered a spiritual successor to Dawngate, being developed by O7 Studios, 14 talented volunteers working around the globe together. They are developing a game similar to Dawngate, with a lot of comparable ideologies, similar design and similar artwork. Second is a total remake of the original game, called Reborn of Dawngate, or Dawngate Reborn, by Min SZX. Using a lot of the original assets and using the Unity engine, Min has been able to reproduce a lot of the game's core already in a handful of weeks and is currently concentrating on the possibility of a network test. And third, another solo project, definitely not Dawngate by Morat himself. Similar to Min's work, he's been able to use all the in-game assets and reproduce the game in Unreal Engine 4, recently being featured on Thor's stream, showing off some of the assets he's completed and are currently working on, including basic movement and idle animations. Morat intends for his project to be as close to the original game as envisioned and is currently working towards getting the game to a playable state. During Thor's recent stream, a lot of new information came to light. EA themselves had intended the game's source to be released to the public for free. However, a unit of networking code that was leased by EA and not developed by Waystone Studios rendered them unable to do so. As they did not own the code, they therefore had no rights to release it for free. Now, with a renewed passion and vigour for the game, could we see a possible version of Dawngate appearing in 2017? I, like many others, are waiting with bated breath to see the culmination of one of these projects, and hope that sometime soon, we'll get our hands on a playable version of the game one way or another. All of the individuals working on these projects are extremely talented and passionate, and I for one hope that in the near future, we will see the Dawngate reopen. I'm Best Melvin EU, and I hope I've gotten you up to speed with what might be happening in the near future with the game. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I hope I'll see you soon. Peace!